Zoom Zoom. You feel it. And with extra value now at Mazda, it's time to own it. Go for Mazda CX-3 Neo from 22490 Drive Away, plus a $500 Go bonus. It's time to go. On air, online, and on your smart speaker. The Listener App. Audio built for your day, anytime, anywhere. Hit News Briefing. Good morning, it's Eloise Arnold with your local news briefing. A man in his 50s has been treated by paramedics this morning after he was struck by a vehicle while cycling. Emergency services were called to the Captain Cook Highway roundabout at Discovery Drive near Kawara Beach at around 6.50am. He was transported to Cairns Hospital in a stable condition with back and head injuries. In other news, a fictional aircraft crash will be simulated on Thursday at the Cairns Airport to facilitate a realistic emergency response. The scenario involves a fictional international passenger flight overshooting the runway and going through a fence and the Saltwater Creek before coming to rest in mangroves. Cairns Airport Chief Executive Officer Richard Barker said facilitating a practical emergency scenario was an important part of Cairns Airport's continued commitment to aviation safety. The exercise will not affect passengers arriving or departing Cairns Airport. And a yellow crazy ants infestation has been discovered in the Goldsboro Valley near Gordon Vale. One of the world's most invasive species, yellow crazy ants are a threat to our fragile ecosystem, the community and the region's economy as a whole. This formidable foe has been present in the Cairns region since 2001. If you think you may have seen yellow crazy ants, please contact the Wet Tropics Management Authority for a free property inspection. <coughs> Taking a look at local sport, bragging rights are on the light in the annual North Queensland vs South Queensland AFL clash this weekend. North Queensland is looking to defend its title, playing on home turf in Cairns in the comp's eighth year. Jen Wren from the Menunda Hawks is a notable player to watch for the women's side and Daniel Jackson from North Cairns for the men's side. Both games get underway at Kazali Stadium on Saturday from 3pm. And want more local news? Get free breaking news about our community. Download the listener app, search for your town and add to your favourites now. Ergon crews work in some tough conditions, but they shouldn't have to deal with threats and violence. They're here to help. There's no excuse for abuse. QITE, one of the largest providers of employment in North Queensland. This is hit weather. Checking the forecast, partly cloudy and 27 degrees in Mariba today. Overnight temperatures falling between 13 and 16 degrees tonight. Our listener app is your new home of local news. Join up to listen live or on demand now. <laughs> 